This is to document starting a formicarium for a Solenopsis Invicta that is South American imported fire ant. That's Jemima. I located her uh, at my job. She was crawling up my leg. She had already cast off her wings, which means she is fertile. She is indeed fertilized. I purchased a bird feeder water to start her enclosure. I boiled this to inhibit bacterial growth. Uh, they're uh, negatively affected by a lot of different contaminants. They make their own antibacterial but they still are very delicate. And what we're doing today is adding some water. Some cotton as a stopper. I would prefer to use nylon cotton balls because they inhibit mold growth. She's already begun to lay some eggs. So she's going to be a little tough to coerce into a new habitat. Here's the water reservoir. A few little tiny eggs. Those will hatch within 10 days. And it takes them 25 days to mature into adult fire ants. I doubt she will locate those eggs, but she will start on another clutch of 12. She will start on another clutch of 12 immediately. Variant queens will live up to seven years. I will open up this um, enclosure once every few days to allow some fresh air. They can stay in there for quite a while, a week, without added air. And she will not need any food. She will drink. But she is fed by her worker ants. Regur regur regurgitated food. I'm not sure if that's blurry or not. 
I would offer her honey, but it's only a growth medium for for uh, fungi, and I'm not sure if she would be interested in it anyway. I'll put this against a white background, and perhaps things can see better. And that's Jamama.